What's up guys and welcome back to a new video. Today we are going to take a closer look at the Iwagumi build that I did a couple weeks ago. The tank is doing great. Uh, I think it's three weeks old at the moment. So let's take a closer look. So the tank is doing uh, pretty good actually. I'm really happy with the end result. I also had to trim the plants. Uh, well, the Iliocaris, I had to trim that as well. But the tank is doing perfect. Uh, we have some melting uh, at the moment so further plants are doing perfect but the brasiliensis uh, that I have over there and I had some over here on the front they were melting but I think the new leaves are coming back and it's also happening with the moss um, the moss is starting to melt as well but yeah that's pretty normal when we have some ammonia spikes and then uh, the moss will start to melt at the beginning, but I think that it will be fine later on I have plenty of moss and I will put that uh, back on the rocks as well further Perfect. Uh, no algae at the moment uh, So the current in the habitats are some snails some corona snails in there So they are taking out of the algae, but further it's doing perfect uh, melting is quite normal when you start up a tank uh, I have used some new soil and so it will also give a little bit of ammonia spike. So normally in the first three, one or two weeks, um, sometimes on the third week, we see some little ammonia spikes going on. So what I did is that I did a daily water change in the first week and on the second week, every second day. So that will mean that we still have some control about the algae problems that we can um, have. But uh, I think they turned out pretty well. I don't have any algae problems at the moment, so that's really good. So this is the uh, lean dosing that I use. But Planet Box is a really nice fertilizer that I use every day. The best thing about this product is that I use it every day and I can just use one bottle. Uh, this is just uh, all in one, as I say, it's a lean dosing. And the lean dosing, I'm using that because I have CO2 in the system and I'm working with soil. So so in the fertilizers, you can have the standard version or the lean dosing. That will mean that I dose uh, enough nutrients in the water that my plants can thrive and give uh, vibrant colors, but they're not growing that fast. And that will mean that I don't have to trim as much. They will grow really nice and I don't have any, oh well, of course you can have some algae problems, but when I use the in vitro cups, uh, I start dosing from the beginning. So that's what I have. I use the products from Tenelar. try it out uh, there's a link down below you can uh, purchase these nice quality products yourself and just give it a try so I can't wait until I have a full carpet of Elio Paris that would be amazing so uh, if you have any other suggestions about planting or anything else just let me know down in the comments I'll be happy to read them and I want to say thank you for watching and I will see you next time oh and don't forget keep scaping bye bye